the NFL to Hollywood to fatherhood. Join me as I tackle my next journey in life, becoming Hollywood's next action star. Boom, X Factor time. About to sneak in a lift before picking up my kids. And uh, you know I need a little Morph X5 pre-workout. The A5X creatine, multi-phase creatine. Let's get these pumps going. Let's get after it. A little shaka shaka. Throw it down your galata. Okay, it's time. Here we go. Push day. Working set one, 365 pounds. Let's do it. Ah. <clears throat> Let's go, baby. Ah. Oh, something's off here. Let me see where I put my hands on that. A little bit uneven. Okay. Well, I'll treat that as another warm up. Go to 405. The last time I went to 405, I failed one and a half. Maybe I'll get two reps today. That's the new goal. Audibles. Oh, hey. <laughs> it's just a few cookies, you know? She's a heifer. What's heifer mean? I don't know. I'm going to say my, I got to do this set. I'll the, Google it. Uh, uh, here we go, baby. Ah, bah. Mm. I certainly will not get two. <laughs> it was like you want. I was like, oh, I want. I want to get two, but I. It was like you knew it wouldn't happen. You had it. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was wow. It was, <laughs> have you ever? Do you know it? <laughs> Who does it? No more goofing off. Okay, I just lowered it a little bit. I'm gonna push 365 as many times as I can. Here we go. Oh. 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 Goodness gracious. Great balls of fire. I only got two. I was thinking like four. <laughs> my, uh, my whoop says I'm not very well recovered, so. I would have gotten like five, but I, if I was. Just, try, just keep going, you know? So it's all about grit and resilience, dude. If you're not pushing through on bad recovery days, then you're dead to me. So dead. So. <laughs> No, yeah, you wish it's we're moving too fast. Remember this angle? <laughs> we back, baby. And we ain't never been dead, dog. We know we we've stayed alive. We're always here. Up in the club, 50 cent. Get jiggy with it, homie. I'm not playing anymore. Bang bang. Shots to the double glock. Be ah. <laughs> Let's go. Ooh. Let's see. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Go fast, bang it off the chest. Yeah, you almost won. And it didn't, and that's why I didn't get rep 10. Stop, dude. Fucking idiots. I'm moving to the incline machine press. The heavy, flat barbell benches all for power passion, personal development. The incline machine presses for pumps. 
So go slow, get the deep stretch. Ah, fire it up, all the way up, squeeze it up. Ah, I don't usually even count these so much because the cadence always varies. Sometimes I go slower, sometimes I go faster. Just really wanna get that stretch, get that mind-muscle connection, boom. Ah. 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 Dig deep, blow your air towards your pelvis. Thrust your pubic. And you can bounce out an extra rep. I'm right, gonna get a little bicep tricep in between my sets here. Uh, for realsies, I'm not recovered really well. My whip did say that. So then on low recovery days, instead of just taking the whole day off, that's easy to do. Wait till you're, you're well recovered. That's not always controllable. I can be killer with my sleep and, and diet, and some days it's still just you wake up in the red or the yellow. There can be a lot of things you can't control. It can be stress, it could be a million things. So the gains on days like these turns into kind of the grit, the, oh, how much, how, how heavy could I go when I'm not at all recovered? How psychologically uh, up can I stimulate myself just through thoughts, through music, through pre-workout? <laughs> um, but I mean, I had those days when you were playing football, you got a game day, you might wake up feeling like you got hit by a train, but you gotta go, you gotta find a way and you get sickeningly out of your mind. And uh, it's nice to taste that on these days. I mean, I've had days, I remember uh, one, of the, one of those days, Shane Leckler and you know, a bunch of the vets, they, they took, uh, took me out after one of the training camp days. I remember, this was back when I was drinking, I said, you wanna see my party trick? And they had just ordered doubles. I took a double and chased it with a double. And they thought it was hilarious and it was worth it until the next morning and I puked all over the place. But I had one of the best practices of my life because I thought, I better gear up, dude. I don't want to get cut over something like this. Like, I'm going to go. And my coaches were like, dang, okay. And they all complimented me for, for you know, the next couple of days on that practice. And uh, that was when I, I learned, man, you can get somewhere just mentally. You can find a way. You can turn it into a survival thing and really up your game. Let's go get it. Ran out of battery for a second there. Here we go. Back to it. Oh. Hey. Ah. Uh. Ooh. Ah. Good, good, good. I may have mentioned this already, but my left elbow is kind of tweaked. I've been doing a lot of heavy uh, tricep extensions overhead, and that puts a lot of stress on the elbow. And my, my left one's taking a beating. So for whatever reason, palm up hasn't been bugging me as much. This is still light, but... It allows me to get some volume in uh, during a pseudo injury phase where I'd have to scale back. Always find the reframe. What can you do? Get excited about the things you can do. Oh, <laughs> I'm just seeing this now. I must have left my Mortal Kombat sign on because my wife said if I left it on one more time, she was scared it was going to start a fire and she would take it away and it's not on the wall. And I have no recollection of not turning it off, which means I didn't turn it off, which means it's gone forever. Oh, well, what's the reframe on that? I've got more wall space to put another tacky poster up. Oh, come on. I can't lose. Oh, <laughs> it's on. I didn't know it. I didn't know you ever hold it against me. 
I'm gonna be such a good set for you trying to mug me, homie. <laughs> oh. Hold on, I'm almost done. Let me just wipe the sweat off my face. <laughs> that was my good nip, so I just wanted to show it real quick. All right, here we go. <clears throat> we all got a good nip, you know? They trade off because I only shave one nip every other month, so one's always shaved and <laughs> one's always hairy. So my good one's my shaved one. depending on the viewer. And that's kind of why I like it because depending on who's looking, I always got a good nip instead of it being 50-50 on my nips, you know? <laughs> it's not a laughing matter. It's for serious, dude. I just have another one here, that's all. We're just gonna go one more, guys. All right, just stay with me and we're gonna do it. We have it and we did it. That's called going to failure. That's true RPE zero. Okay, until next time. Per the huge, if you catch my shorthand, I didn't leave myself enough time to make the post-workout shake I'd like to with the oats and banana and peanut butter. But if I could only have one ingredient, it would be my whey protein powder, my isotory bioactive whey. Chocolate sensations. Two scoops, we're doing double, deuce, dose. Taking a deuce into this one with my chocolate sensations. It's a duo scoop. It's a nice little tandem. They work together to give me a 50 gram slam right into my muscles. Thank you, ma'am and sir. Whatever you do and you like it, you freaks.